the former video girl got candid. Ruby Rose had a memorable appearance on the Joe Budden podcast. The rapper talked about lots of different topics, including her start as a video girl. Rose's misconception over how old she was when she appeared in the Bad and Bougie video caused a firestorm online, but she eventually cleared it up. One topic that didn't get as much attention, though, was Ruby Rose's songwriting process. While she's both a rapper and songwriter, according to Wikipedia, she told Budden that she actually didn't pen most of her own lyrics. Joe Budden got very frank very fast with his guest, and this included her musical output. Rose's debut album is set for release in 2024, and the ex-rapper was curious how much she played a hand in writing her songs. The answer? She doesn't. At all. Joe Budden asked Ruby Rose point-blank if she wrote her songs and she said simply, No. There was a moment of awkward laughter when she responded, but the rest of the podcast panel broke out in applause. They commented Rose's honesty, and then things took a comedic turn when she turned the tables on Button. Do you? She asks the ex-rapper. Things erupted once again and Button smiled before confirming that, yes, he does. Ruby Rose also clarified that she's not a gang member the debate over writers has reached a fever pitch in hip-hop over the last decade. A lot of the slander has been thrown at Drake, especially in light of the reference tracks that keep surfacing online. Most of the slander, however, has been reserved for female rappers. Koi Lure's pen game was questioned after demos with lyrics similar to hers leaked in 2022. She hopped on Instagram Live to clear the air. I'm here to speak for myself and I do want to give a little education real quick, she asserted. My whole album. I mean every single feature written by me so I know my pen game is super amazing. Ruby Rose's transparency is surprising, even by 2024 standards. She was similarly open about the fact that she wasn't a gang member. The topic came up after the rapper was seen throwing up gang signs and wearing red in 2022. I'm not actually a gang member, she said on the Big Facts podcast. I know that's kind of like a joke on the internet. I was around gang members and I just like throwing their gang signs up because it's cute. I love the color red. I'm in no way a gang member though. It's hard to tell if Rose will have a long career, but it's inarguable that she's being real with her fans.